and welcome back. I hope you're all well. So today I'm going to be doing a Christmas clean with me. I have a list of a couple of bits that I want to get done today. I've just set myself little tasks to do around the house. It is a really gloomy and rainy day and I've just looked at the weather for the rest of the week and it doesn't look that great. So it is the perfect day to get some cleaning done. I've got my gingerbread coffee and I'm ready to go. So give this video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it and you found it motivating to get some cleaning done yourself before the Christmas rush next week. And also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'd love to have you as part of the PBB community. And with that being said, let's get right into the video. <laughs>
she read. You guys, I spoke about this. You can't even see me in the shop. I mentioned about this cushion on my YouTube stories. Well, I don't know if it's a cushion as such. It's actually a toy, but they're called Squish Mallows. And I got one of these thanks to Angie Bellema here on YouTube. She has the most amazing, inspirational, and motivational, and festive videos. So I'll link her channel down below. These were $6.99 from Audi. They have loads of different ones. And Sully loves sitting on Gina. Don't you? You love Gina, don't you? Is that your new lady friend? It is, isn't it? Down through the chimney with lots of toys All for the little one's Christmas joy that I wanted to do today was DIY another garland for on top of the kitchen cupboards. Just because I have this spare garland that I picked up from Poundland a few years ago. So what I'm hoping to do is cut this to size on all of the kitchen cupboards, then add in maybe a few berries, ribbon and some cones. to put up on top of the cupboards because of the wire, the wire's a bit stiff so it's just balancing on the cupboards so hopefully it's okay. The pine cones and berries are kind of just placed in the garland. I'm not sure if next time I would decorate the garland down on the worktop and then bring it up onto the cupboards and I think I need some more smaller sprigs of berries. I think these would work a little bit better on this garland just because the big berry ones are quite hard to weave in and out. They're much easier to do on the staircase one that I've got. So that will do for now. It still looks really nice and festive in here, which was the aim. So guys, thank you so much for watching and I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and I will look forward to seeing you in my next video. Take care guys, bye.